and welcome to a cup of coffee and Sumi Inc. 60 Kuretake tryout, testing out, whatever. I have not a proper name for it yet, but uh, my good friend uh, Simonessa, who's also very into drawing, he uh, gave me a tip uh, about this. This is uh, an unopened Sumi Ink 60 and it's very smooth flowing Sumi Ink for manga drawing and it's a SIG cartoonist bottle. And I have prepared before this video this little sheet right here and we're gonna try out to see if this is the ink for me. And I have not tried it yet so I thought it would be a cool video to share with you guys uh, of uh, me trying out this ink for drawing. And we should probably do a test first, just straight on to paper, and then do a comic test of this. We're gonna do the comic first, uh, and then we're gonna let it dry, and then try to add some watercolor to it to see how it is. So, uh, I'm always using these. I'm gonna try out the Kuretake uh, tip pen as well. But right now, we're just gonna use the same that I've had. So. Open it, see if it's safe. Woo! Tastes like, uh, taste, <laughs> it smells like um, uh, soap. Okay, let's try this out. Let's see, turn you around a little bit like this, and like this. And then, uh, okay, we did not plan that far. There we go. Now you can see the ink, yeah. And now we're gonna try it out. Dip it in there, first try, and this is Ken trying out. Uh, what's it called again? Trying out Sumi Ink 60 from from Kura Talk See this video on my YouTube channel. Really whoring it out there. So now you can see this video that I'm making. Link in bio. Biatch. <laughs> so far so good. Uh, they, the ink is very nice to draw with. And I'm gonna also order one of those uh, pro pens. So let's see. Close here so you can see how it looks. So trying to make like a YouTuber video here now. Do it like this and then dip it in. <laughs> as she said, and then it's Ken here, and he's, oh yeah, it's really good, like this is even better than the, the shit one that I, the Parker thing that I had, which was really good, but this is uh, really fucking good, because it's not bleeding out, like it's still, uh, I don't know how to say this, but it's, when I'm drawing with this now, oh shit, Fucked up his body there. Whatever. Uh, the ink is staying inside of this tip field pen thing. And it's really fluid-like. Add some teeth. So, till now it's really fucking satisfying. Like this... So we have Ken there. 
and then I'm gonna do the bubble. What I'm really excited is how will the ink be when it's dried. So far, so good. So it looks a little bit weak though, but it might be me as well that hasn't uh, gotten used to how much ink to have in it. Well, let's find out. This, and then we have the ink here on the side. Open box there. We, we, we. There you go. Okay. And then, okay, we tried this now. And now let's try how it is to do with a brush. Let's see if I can get you. Do not think about the angles here though. So, okay, let's try it this way. Like, yeah, this is good. And we have the ink here. Okay, it does seem very, there it is, that's better. So now we're gonna try and see how it is to paint with. like overdo the strokes a little bit yeah it looks fucking good that's for sure okay i'm taking the piece on there and then it's little eyes mm. And then writing it like this. Testing. The. Ink. With. A. Brush. Yeah. Let's see how it is if we add this. Uh, did not prepare for this though. And if we do, oh shit, uh, filthy water here now though, but fuck it. If we add, so we add ink and water it out and how will it look then it's now just added water to it to like skim it out a little bit maybe even have it here more oops that was a little bit too much mm -hmm. now we can use this we can dry it up like this soak up a little bit of it But it looks good though. And then we're gonna have some on top here. Frame in the text bubble. And then color in with the watercolor afterwards. Yeah, looks it looks like it dries fast. That's good. Because I work pretty fast sometimes, but again, when I'm doing this kind of coloring, then I am, um, of course, letting doing all the black lines first, and then letting it dry, and then adding color. So we might fuck up on the on this one because it's not dry yet. 
but I don't have the patience to wait. So let's see how it looks. Uh, if it's reacting to the to the ink or if it's going smooth. Okay. So now we've tried just uh, putting the ink with the tip pen and then we did a brush just to do two different kind of uh, styles here and now for the exciting part really exciting part we're gonna put a lid on it this for now and then we are gonna try uh, and color this motherfucker so let's see how that is I'm gonna add some put in here, bum bum. Okay, so let's see how this works. Done it. Is it good like this? No, it's not. Aha! Whoops! There you go. Okay, so let's see that this. Oh shit, we fucked up there, but fuck it. We should have let this dry, but let's see if uh, it's possible to. Oh yeah, that was a dirty fucking brush. So we have to take a new one. This is probably way too big. That's what she said, but fuck it, let's try it. Oh yeah, that's a filthy fucking yellow got right there. Ah, the ink is dry. No, it's not. <laughs> so we're gonna go for this guy. So I haven't let it dry yet. Ah, but it seems to work. Though. This one is dry. So with the pencil, it's it's dry now, as you can see. Let's just get that yellow in there, and then let's try the. Some blue hair in the background. So this ink has dried. Yeah. So I'm not letting it dry now though, so we should wait. Because uh, it doesn't do it uh, justice now, because I haven't let the ink dry yet. But we're trying just to see how this is. I'm so used to the other ink, so okay. so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna uh, let this dry, and if you go to my Instagram, you can see this comic strip in its full, full finished uh, drawing, and I'm gonna add, I'm gonna post. Let's see if I, yeah, I'm gonna post. Some of them on my Instagram and then some on my on my Patreon page. So uh, for now, the judgment on the Sumi Ink 60 from Kuretake is very positive. I like it and I like that it's a bottle like this, so it's solid when I'm drawing. So for now, the ink looks really good, but go to my Instagram and I will do all the black outlines, let it dry, and then color in with watercolor. Because now we did it a little bit too fast. I just wanted you guys to see me try it out the first time I tried it, and, uh, and it's, it's very good. And this is water-based pigment smudge proof with alcohol-based markers. But if it's water-based pigment, I don't know if it's, if it's good with watercolor then. That's a bit weird. Hmm. Smudge proof with alcohol based markers. Okay, what if we try just for fun now? What's alcohol? Alcohol based markers. Is that like a. Sharpie, maybe? 
have a shot this morning. I had a sharpie somewhere. Of course, I was not planning on this though. If you're still watching, with the server reward. Yeah, check out this dude's YouTube video and he's looking for stuff. That's really interesting. Where's the fucking sharpie when you need? I had tons of sharpies, but now I just can't see one damn sharpie. Uh, Great. Oh, I think this is alcohol, please. No. Are you fucking kidding me? There's one single fucking sharpie inside. Wait, okay. Oh. Oh. Congratulations, Martin. You just made the most interesting video in the world. Is this alcohol based permanent marker? Doesn't say though. Fuck. Okay, maybe I should have prepared a little bit more for this video, but I didn't, so. Sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Is Faber Castell alcohol based? I don't think so. Mm. Damn it! Fucking kidding me. Okay, now it's just fucking embarrassing. Oh! Knew it! Sharpie. Point. Is it permanent? I don't know if it's alcohol based. Let's try it. Let's try it on Vic. So let's try it on this one. E. Cause it's good like that though, but I don't use these at all, but we're just trying out different shit here now. So I'm gonna, again, I'm gonna let this dry and then see how it looks. Let's try it right now though. Cause it seems like it's dry here now. So let's try the blue again. And let's see how it, if it reacts. Okay, this is not looking good. <laughs> it seems like this too is fucking... Ah! Never find any good fucking ink. Like, it looks like it reacts. Yeah, it's the same as the fucking other thing, I think. Fuck. Because this is... Well, it's not dry. Is there? This is pretty dry, and now with water, it reacts. It's like the only ink that I've ever tried that actually works uh, is this one, in the ink graphic. And it's a fucking expensive, it's 45 milliliter. And these ones are 60 millimeters, I think. So like that. It's more in these and these are cheaper and it's like the proper fucking manga ink and shit but this one which is black opage blah, 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 ink for graphic instruments and drawing but this is india ink and that's this is the best ink that i've had but it's too thick so she said for this kind of pens so it's a little bit i'm still not giving up on this though so go check out on my instagram though i'm gonna draw it out the lines now let it dry and then see if it reacts with the watercolor. For now it doesn't look good, but let's try. Because it's water based, so that's why I'm fearing it. Anyway, thanks for watching though. New video every Friday. And I will see you on my live stream on Instagram at 13.00. So go check that out. And thanks for watching.